Hey everyone and welcome to WPMU Dev, your all-in-one WordPress platform. Today, I'll be showing you how to use Ajax in WordPress by creating a simple plugin from scratch. But before we get started, you might be wondering what is Ajax? Ajax is a web development technique that stands for Asynchronous JavaScript and XML. It's used to create dynamic web applications that are interactive and fun. With Ajax, you don't have to wait for the web page to reload to see a change. You can continue what you're doing while the browser and the server take care of changes automatically in the background. You've probably come across Ajax on the web already. Google Search's autocomplete feature is perhaps the most popular one. Google Maps, YouTube Likes, love reactions these are some of the incredible user experiences which are all powered by ajax and related technologies so how does ajax work exactly ajax uses a combination of web technologies to do its thing they include html css javascript xml or json and any server-side scripting language such as php or asp.net Here's a quick overview of Ajax at work. A user action such as a button click or a key press triggers an event in the browser. This activates the Ajax call which sends a request to the server. The server side script processes this request and then sends a response back to the browser. A second JavaScript code called a callback function processes this response and updates the web page on the browser without reloading it. It's getting a bit clearer now, isn't it? So, what are the advantages of Ajax? Well, quite a few. It minimizes bandwidth usage and server load, as the servers will be processing only the content that's to be updated and not the full page data. It saves time for both the users and the server as the response for the browser actions happen immediately. Increased performance. Since no full page data is being sent, Ajax improves performance, speed and usability of web pages. Increased responsiveness. By eliminating full page reload, websites will be much swifter and highly responsive. Thus, more user friendly too. Impressive, isn't it? Let's now understand how Ajax works WordPress. It starts off with the user triggering an Ajax request in the browser. This request is passed to the admin ajax.php file, which can be found in the WP admin folder of the WordPress installation. The Ajax request needs to supply at least one piece of data, which is done using the get or post method. This data value is called the action. Ajax.php script uses the action value to create two hooks. The first hook executes only for logged in users, while the second one fires only for logged out users. The functions defined in the hooks work with jQuery and other JavaScript files to send a response back to the browser, which processes the response and updates the web page without reloading it. If you're new to this, this may seem quite complex. But once you've seen it in action, it'll all get better. Let's now build a simple WordPress Ajax plugin to get started. We'll be building a plugin called Post Likes Counter with the following features. Only logged in users can like posts. The plugin keeps a tally of the total number of post likes and displays them. The Post Likes Counter is updated instantaneously on the browser. Logged out users will be echoed a message if they attempt to like a post. To start off, create an empty plugin and activate it. Here's how you do it. Create a folder called Post Likes Counter in your WordPress installation's plugins directory. Then, create a Post Likes Counter.php file with the default plugin header as shown. All the code snippets shown in this video can be copied from the blog post linked in the description. Alright, 
once you've created the plugin PHP file, upload it inside the new plugin folder. Finally, go to the plugin section in your WordPress dashboard and activate it. As of now, this plugin does absolutely nothing. It's just a base for you to build on. Next, you need to find your theme single.php post template. It can be found in your active themes root folder. This file is used to display posts whenever they are queried. We need to prepare your posts for an Ajax call by adding the code shown here. I recommend you to add it after the post content, but before the author bio section. You can also add this code to any of the template parts your single.php file includes. Once added and saved, your blog should now have a like this post link along with the post like counter. Clicking this link will run the admin ajax.php script but you won't see any output yet as you have not created any functions to address your ajax call. Let's do that now. We'll define it so that it works even without javascript. This is to ensure graceful decantation. In case the browser has javascript disabled for some reason. Go to your plugin file and add the functions to the two hooks that were created by WordPress. Follow the code shown here. If you want to understand what the code does exactly, you can go to the blog post and check the comments under the code section. Okay. Make sure to save your plugin file. When a logged in user clicks the like this post link now, the like counter value should increase by 1. This only works for browsers with JavaScript disabled, where the page will refresh with the updated like count. The function to handle logged out users doesn't do much here except for echoing a message. It's only meant to serve as an example. You can, of course, build on this and give your site visitors more helpful options. Let's add support for JavaScript now. This is where the Ajax magic comes alive. To do that, Include jQuery library as well as your custom JavaScript code in your plugin file. After that, create the likerscript.js JavaScript file as shown here and then upload it to the file location referenced in the plugin code. The myUserLike function defined in our plugin will send the browser a response as a JSON result array, which can also be used as a JavaScript object. The Ajax callback function uses this response to store and update the post like count, all without reloading the web page. And that's it, you have now enabled Ajax functionality for your plugin. This is our humble plugin at work here. You can add styles, animations and other scripts to level it up as you like. Ajax is a powerful tool in your web development arsenal to enhance website performance and user experience. What will you do with it? The floor is yours to take now.